Welcome back to PMC's Airwaves newsletter. I'm Gio San Giovanni. 2022 is now in full swing and it already promises to be our best year yet. We at PMC have seen unprecedented growth in the number of shows produced, the number of members and producers that use PMC's facilities, and the number of responses and interactions we've had with you, our community. But in the midst of this exciting growth, it's important to remember what PMC is all about, to provide free speech TV and media solutions to everyone, no matter your background or your economic standing. And PMC has stayed true to that mission. To show you what I mean, let's talk about Cedric Mufaranzima and his new game show. PMC is excited to announce Game Night, a new trivia and game show created and hosted by Cedric Mufaranzima. Join in on the fun every Friday night at 9.30 p.m where only one team can take home the great prize. Game Night draws inspiration from the groundbreaking game shows of history, such as Julian Lepers, Steve Harvey, Alex Trebek, Johnny Carson, Rodney Dangerfield, Jimmy Kimmel, and Wayne Brady. It encapsulates trivia's lighter, playful, and engaging manner and strives to be fun and challenging. Next up, let's talk about Jerry Edwards and the Kindling Fund Grant. PMC would like to congratulate Jerry Edwards for being selected to receive a Kindling Front Grant for 2022. This grant will be used to increase the visual and merchandising capacity of the Gem City Movement, a creative collective of main musical artists. The Kindling Fund supports artists organized projects that engage audiences and incorporate the visual arts in inventive and meaningful ways. We are so excited to have a member of PMC's community be awarded this grant. We look forward to seeing the positive impact it will have on the art scene in Portland. Now let's talk about Harold Patius and his new show. Harold Patius is back with the latest edition of Patius on the News. This month, Harold interviews the new Chancellor of the University of Maine System, Daniel Malloy. Chancellor Malloy began his career as an Assistant District Attorney in New York and later became the mayor of Stamford, Connecticut, serving four terms in office. Don't miss this exciting conversation about the challenges of running the university system during these trying times. Watch every Wednesday night at 7 on Channel 5, or watch anytime by going to portlandmedia.org slash watch. Next up, let's talk about a new show by Lisa Savage. Pathways to Progress is a new monthly show at PMC that features former U.S. Senate candidate Lisa Savage hosting a half-hour conversation with Portland City Council's newest members, Victoria Pelletier and Roberto Rodriguez. Pathways to Progress offers viewers an inside look into the life of a new city councilor navigating complex nuances as they work to initiate change and speak for their constituents. Watch Tuesday nights at 7 on Channel 5 or watch anytime on PMC's YouTube channel. PMC has seen impressive growth this year and it's exciting to see faces we've never seen before walk through these doors. But sometimes we need to say goodbye to friends we've known for so long and have met through the work we've done here at PMC. All of us at PMC are saddened to hear of the passing of Yura Subans. Uris was a teacher, a leader, a collaborator, and a promoter of the arts here in Maine. We at PMC have been fortunate to have him on the board of directors for so many years, and we learned so much from his teachings. He was dedicated to the work we do, and was an active member of both PMC and the greater Portland community. He will be most remembered for his cheerful nature and a smile that lifted everyone's spirits. We will miss his presence in our community and the dedication he brought to his work. This January has been an exciting start to a promising year, and we hope that February brings as much progress as January has. From everyone here at PMC, we wish you a happy and warm winter season. We'll see you next month with more important updates. And until then, stay safe, stay warm, and keep creating.